Thank you so much for joining me as Gamage. We are back in Die Young, and this is Apricot Valley. And again, if you're enjoying this series, take the time, hit the like button. Tell me in the comment fields uh, you want to see more of this. And again, thank you so much for your support. You guys are absolutely awesome. Now, we did head out to look around a little bit here. There's a way to go back out through there, but I think we're going to take the route over here. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go and take this route over here. Uh, just to make sure nothing happens, it's too bad. Afterwards, we're going to put some gloves on. Oh, just to make sure, okay? Let's put our gloves on. Uh, this is, these help a lot. We found them last episode. If you guys wondering how to find them, where that key is located. And uh, we just got a little bit of a sketch going on here. Where's this here? Find woman, find man. Which one is it? Items? Why is it showing up under items here? I don't see anything. Oh! Locker key. All right, that's locker key show up. Sorry, I thought it was something extra, but it's not. It's all good. There's a path right there to it, right? Didn't have to jump down. Be you know me. Check when the water. Just double check. Can we drink this? I cannot drink it. Look at that. That's so nice. So nice. I hear the frogs. Just don't see them. I believe we've been here before. I remember coming through here. Stream goes right out to that wall. I was gonna double check it. Oh, not a stream. It's just a, a path. And it goes out over there too. We are located here. That can go up there too. Okay, so that's good to know. We have other path on that side. Get more mushrooms. We need to make some more poisons, which we're not using too much of. I'll be honest with you. Maybe we will afterwards. I'm gonna go up to the house and check it out. I'm really curious. And there's all the apricots in there. Real nice, like endless amounts of fruits here to eat. Okay, he might not be as friendly. Let's go and check this out. They did say some villagers won't be as friendly. Hopefully she will. How you doing? Doing good? Yeah, okay. You guys aren't exactly the toughest, aren't you? Hey, how you doing? Are you talking to? Are you talking of? Are you talking of? Are you talking of? <laughs> yes, you are. All right, finally, someone who can talk to me. All right. Finally, someone who wants to talk with me. Whoa, calm down. First of all, lower your voice, because my head is pounding as it is. Okay. What did you want to tell me? We've been kept awake for nights by noises coming from the cellar. Maybe you could sort out this problem. Oh, yeah, we've been here before. Me? Sort out your problem? That's right. The cellar is sealed off and nobody can get in. Could you go take a look? Okay. How am I supposed to get inside if it's sealed shut? We're not sure. But we think there's another way in. A comrade of mine searched for it without success. I tell you to go talk with him about it, but he left with no explanation. Oh well. Okay. Uh, Why do I have to help you? You'll bring back sound sleep to everybody. You think you won't be compensated for this? Why don't you go have a look yourselves? And risk being bitten by rats and snakes? We've tried asking for help from the guards, but lately they've been taking care of more important matters, they say. Never mind. Listen, I just want to get away from here. What do you say about first fixing my problem? Okay. I think I'll get moving along now. I'll return to my work then. Which is what's sitting down, dude? Alright. How you doing? You guys all want some sleep, I guess? Can't take care of your little rat problem yourself. Or snakes. You guys have anything over here? Hiding? No. Alright. Okay, so I'm not sure. Can we go in the house itself? I, I believe they let us in, right? So we can look inside the house. There's a whole bunch of boots and stuff here. I remember we used to be able to search these things. I keep on saying that, but I, I don't know if that's gone now. It's just they chose to take it away. 
Alright, some cloth. Alright, let's see here. Uh, To-do list. No, he's in a cellar. We're going to make that as active right now. Find a way to the cellar. There's some water if you want to. You just have to hold down and drink, I guess. Pretty cool. Not a problem with water. They made it sound like it would be a lot worse. All right, back outside. All right, more water sources. That's what's drawn. Okay. Can't see any flowers. Nope. Lock from the other side. That must be the cellar. Tons of apricots here. Eat. Endless amounts. They sealed it completely. Holy crap. Oh, that's a cellar door. They sealed it. Let's just knock it down with a sledge, man. Just saying. Okay, so we need to find a way out uh, down there. I think we can go up there, too. I remember going through that second floor window beforehand. We've been here before. I don't know how come. Alright, searching for this damn place. Where's the entrance? I don't remember where the hell the entrance is. Was it down near? No way there. Hmm. This looks completely different than last time, but uh, is there a hillside I can jump off? Oh, this is the part eh? we can go back from. We were looking at last time. We couldn't get up there. Yeah, okay. We'll go back and visit there too. We have to double check every last thing on this map. I believe there's always something that's hiding. Now, they said there's a second way in here. Um, maybe there is a uh, cellar on the ground somewhere or a hole or something we can just kind of jump into. Maybe behind that wall. Yeah, this never checked behind the wall. Jesus Christ, you have a station of animals here. Maybe behind that bush. Nothing. Not even place to save either. This looks kind of odd. Nope. I thought maybe there would have been a way from underneath. I think there is. I remember it being something underneath here. There it is. Oh, yes. Okay, I remember that. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we have gloves on, right? Take them off. I think we're going to parkour. Them. Shit! Okay, I don't remember that part. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. So. Can we push this? Okay. I take this box over here. And push that right there. Okay. I don't remember what to do next here. This lifted up a tiny bit. Still too low. There we go. Alright, that lifted up where we needed it. Awesome. Okay, you know what? I think I'll use a baton for this. Those things do a good enough job, and I don't want to waste the good stuff, so we're going to take number four. Four for that one. There we go. Here! Creepy creepies. Rope. Awesome. Food, some more water. Not a problem, really. Some notes and stuff will come right back. I want to see if there's anything around here. To kill before and I really heard little footsteps. There is a uh, wine and stuff down here. More bottles. Another crowbar. 
very cool. Guess we start using them, Chris. <laughs> Alright, we'll pick up what we can at this point. Look at like there's any of those creepy things over here. Dave, I found you sleeping and preferred not to wake you up. I'm sorry to leave you by yourself here for all this time, but I cannot do otherwise. Uh, the others would get suspicious. I heard you uh, in your delirium, and they're still asking themselves where the shouts are coming from. I hope the medicine that I brought you for you to take effects soon. So it looks like you, somebody was down here sick. I don't know uh, when I'll be able to return. I've left you a recipe f uh, and materials to prepare a new dose if you need them. All right, cool. I guess we're going to learn something. In the meantime, I hope you reflect on what we've talked about. Believe me, the trials are necessary evil. And once you enter the... In, to become part of the community, you will feel like a new man. I've put a lot of thought into it, and I've convinced myself to helping you is the right thing to do. As soon as you've got your uh, strength back, I'll accompany you on your path for as far as I can. And ooh, up in the area in a resurgence. I know that is difficult, but I have faith in you. All right, good for him. It looks like there's a trials and tribulations here for this dude. All right, new recipe added. We got ourselves into here. Right here. Extracts on herbs, uh, slow revitalization effects, slow recovers health. Very cool. Ugh, not too long ago, someone bled a lot here. It's better than we usually use, say. <laughs> that's, that's much better, actually. Okay, what do we have here? We have uh, cloth. We have one rope so far, so hopefully we can find more. It looks like she, yeah, so he, he left him down here after a certain amount of time, I guess, hoping he'd get better. I'm not sure if that's the reason why. That must be the reason why he left. I'm not positive what we're going to to get upstairs here. I'm worried about that. And nothing else. Okay, so he can't... I can't go and break through that. Can I break through that? I wonder if I could just break through it. I mean... No. Figure we could. So there wasn't any rodents or anything. That we know of. I grabbed everything, right? I keep on saying that. I believe I grabbed everything. I, I, I hate doing this, but I... It's my gut feeling saying double check everything. There's several some room back there. It doesn't look like it goes anywhere. Okay. Take the space bar. We're back down to where we were. How do we get back out of here? I didn't see any rats or anything, so I think their problem is solved now. Just say we did it. Don't tell them anything. It's not worth it. Just tell them we did all the work and everything is fine. We've got no problems. Taking the high road of this one saying, yeah, we did it. Hey, we're open that one. Oh, right here. Shit. Okay, wait a second. Let's see here. I'm running low on room. So I'm going to craft up another one of those. Our final bag piece. Maxed out. Yes. We did it. Cool. All right. We took care of your problem, dude. Concerning your problem. What do you want to know? I managed to get into the cellar. Really? What did you find there? Mm, so it was empty. Somebody had used to be hide out in a while. Uh, an injured man used to hide out there. I want to. And one of you helped him. Hmm. Which one should I do? I can do this one. An injured man used it as a hideout, and one of you helped him. Oh really? So that's why my comrade moved away from the valley. Anyways. These matters are of no concern to you. I think I've earned your help. Well, yes, you've earned it. Ask me what you want, and I'll see whether I can sort you out. 
Okay. Can I offer? What can you offer me? Hmm. What can you offer me? Feel free to take apricots from our orchard. No. Even though you probably helped yourself already, right? Stop for a moment and reflect. Have you ever given such value to food? Why should I think about the value of food now? You know, modern society has never cared about the labor of us farmers. We provide food that promptly gets wasted. Don't you think that's like spitting on our efforts? Modern society? I no longer wanted to work for a society based on consumerism. Here, nothing is thrown. Everything has importance, even leftovers. Our work is respected, and we can finally work happily. Here I can till the soil, and no multinational can take it away from me. Basically, you weren't happy with your old life? Try and understand me. Modern society, among other things, pushed me to burn old bridges. Unfortunately, I had a fight with my son. We haven't talked in a decade. He wanted me to sell my land to a multinational. I would never have allowed it, but he went behind my back and I lost everything. I said goodbye to my property and to my son. What can you tell me about this island? It seems like a world of its own. It is, and we're happy that it is. Out there, unfortunately, they're not yet ready to embrace a socialist community such as ours. Why do you all wear bandanas over your faces? All men are born equal. The bandana reminds us that nobody is better than anybody else. And what do you have to say about the dead bodies? You can't see further than your nose. Brother number one wants to re-educate you. You must merit your place in our community. Who is this brother number one? Who is it? It's the man who built all of this. He carved out a paradise for us away from the system. I see you're all very quiet around here. We live in a place where the worker is valued. We are content with what we have. This community gives only good things to its adepts. But does the world out there know about this place? Brother number one convinced Turkey to recognize the value of what we're building. Nobody can disturb us. Huh. By the way, so there is a way to leave this place? Get away? Why would you? Once you overcome the trials, you will no longer want to leave. Don't give up. Trial? Do you mean some sort of test? It's up to you to find out what I mean. In any case, when you arrive, you'll understand immediately. Okay, I'm fucked. I get it. Yep, yeah, you're, you're kind of fucked. I think I'll get moving along now. I'll return to my work then. So he's not giving me anything at all? There's nothing at all, is there? I think I'll get moving along now. Great, all I'll that. I'll return to my work then. And nothing. Nothing. Uh, I do believe there's a way in that window up there. I remember doing that. I just don't remember how I did that. We're just gonna go back inside here. No, there's stairs. I think that's a doorway that goes here, upstairs, and that's where we have to go and head up. So I'm gonna have to go and try and figure out how that works out. I don't know if I use a tree or maybe jump off a ledge onto it. it. Might be a ledge. I'm not positive how that worked out, how I did that. I did do it though. I remember doing it. I just don't remember how. <laughs> You gotta appreciate that, and we'll just see if we can go a little higher here on this. We'll go back and get the water and stuff we need. Oh, look at that. That's a beautiful thing to find. That's the reason why I want to go up here. Oh, yes. Okay, so we got a little spot to do some stuff here. We can drop it off. 
some loot. Okay, so we placed everything back inside. We're gonna make a run for it onto here. I think we can reach the top of this. Just like that. Ooh, through the window. All right, nothing in the seats. This looks like a freaking empty room. Very empty. I will have the bottom part here just to make sure. And that's gonna lead us back to the front. We should go and get some water and stuff. Oh, crap, that's locked. All right, we're gonna go back downstairs and get some water. Ismail, whoops, Ismail, right there, written. Okay. Do you have any rope or anything hidden behind you, Ismail? No. Got some cloth though. I'll take it. Nice little drawing of a animal, a dog, I think. And there's a house. Anything specific? No, just sheep and stuff. Just happy, happy pictures. Happy, happy. I don't see the kids though. I don't know if that that should be worrisome or not. All right. Well, there's nothing else around here. I'm thinking we have to maybe have to go over the roof and go inside that house. Inside. Okay, oh, let's go to the top peak here. Buddy. There we go. Can I jump at all? Oh, Jesus. It worked. Okay. What a drag. Having to relocate is just a mess. We have to hurry because in two days we'll be leaving. It's decided I've been packing stuff by myself for a week now. Mom and Dad are overloaded. With work, and my bro little brothers are always uh, on the hunt for adventure. Little goons acting like uh, they're in a movie searching for pirates, ship treasures. <laughs> uh, life can't, uh, can't be so carefree. Luckily, there was deliria and volleyball. All right. Okay, my parents are pressuring me. To, uh, I'm the big one. I do packing, so my little brothers and the other hands are free to blank around the treehouse for as long as they want to uh, want horse shit. So he's obviously very unhappy. He must be a teenager. Uh, the village and the things and change ensure that in a happy place. I can't wait to go. It's just so annoying. That's why I'm responsible for all the packing. First, I'll miss this house, but really, it won't be hard to get over it, right? Last day, we can uh, wait anymore. I packed everything I could. My mom already said that uh, for now, we can't take everything along. A few things we left behind. Stored in a barn. All right, so there's a barn somewhere. Recap. Shoes, check. Horror movie videotape collection, check. <laughs> Favorite bands, t-shirt, check. I've taken everything, but I couldn't find my volleyball. Knee pads. Ooh. My... Parents might have already packed them up without telling me. So meddlesome. Anyways, I've decided to leave my diary here. This way, whoever takes our place will remember that this was first home to a girl called Nuray. All right. Awesome. Thanks, Nuray. We just took your diary. No one's ever going to know that. All right. That's great. That's good to know. So, yeah, somewhere in a barn, there's some stuff that they packed. And knee pads. Now that no mistake, that's the only part we have to get for ourselves. And a flute. I don't know what the flute's for. There's a door. Awesome. There's nothing here we can open up, right? I'm looking for something else. We can make ourselves another one. Now these things, I believe, uh, since we've well, taken care of most of our business, we'll craft crafted up. Now right here, and clunk. Let's do it. We now moved up to 21 things we can carry. We can still do it again. So that's good news. We'll go down the stairs. We don't have to go across. I thought I saw something flashing up there. And we probably have to build ourselves a fire, I think, this time around. I don't see any other way. There is a save point upstairs we can probably do. I don't see any fires or anything around here, right? Abercot, there doesn't seem to be anything around here for us to kind of save up our stuff. Uh, let me double check here. I think I remember seeing... Yep. I was thinking that. There we go. A little bit of cloth issues. 
There's some apricots here again. It's too bad we can't carry more with us. I wish we could just pick them up since they're allowing us. All right, more cloth there. Should probably look around a little harder. God damn it. <laughs> what the hell? That's where we went downstairs. We're good. Well, we can either start a fire here if we want to and pause it here since we've gone through all this extra workload already. Uh, it's been pretty crazy. If you guys want to admit that, there's a pretty darn crazy story. So we're probably going to leave the episode here. We did finish up this fine building, and I don't know where we have to go next. I, I really don't. We finished up pretty much all that. And we still have the to-do list here, which is dead romance to find them. So I guess that's where... Oh, shit, you scared me. So let's see if we can craft up the fire. If people have been asking me to do it, I'm going to do it anyways. Uh, I'm probably going to do it from the top of that area. So if we come out, we can probably save from there. I don't want to come down to the village every single time. Sorry, dude. I'm going to need some more belts. I am. My apologies. Excellent. Okay, so let's do this here. We'll craft up a fire. And craft and abilities. Uh, there it is. So it's going to take up, what, one piece of stick? All right, cool. Now, inventory now, I guess? The first time I craft this up. All right, we're going to do four. Excellent. Four will place you down. You suit. What did it say? Why can't I use it? Okay. We're just going to save like this. That's what it is, isn't it? Let's let me do it here. There you go. Quick save. Okay, so they don't actually give you it. But they actually... It just, that's fine. I thought they actually placed down the actual campfire, but they do not. So it's all good. So we're fine. We're doing great. It is 4 o'clock. We still have some time to go investigate a tiny bit of the Apricot Valley here. And again, there's still some stuff here. I'm curious to know what the hell that is on this side. Uh, we still have to go back through this area and also back around here to open up the mount pass, which is another thing we have to go and do. So there's a lot for us to explore still, and it's endless. So thank you so much for being here. I do appreciate it. Again, if you're enjoying us, take the time, hit the like button. If you're brand new, please go ahead and subscribe. You guys are the best. This is Game Edge, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.